Hey y'all, what is up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Wildflower Tea and as you can tell by the thumbnail today we are going to be talking about Miss Mama June and her latest antics. Apparently last night Mama June made her appearance as a plaintiff on Court Not Live which airs on A&E where she did sue her former friend and YouTuber Adam Barda. Y'all this one is extremely interesting and after doing some research I find it even more interesting but before we get into my opinions let me go ahead and run down the dates for you so on last night's episode of court not live mama june showed up seeking five thousand dollars from adam after allegedly trying to work with him and consult with him from february to august on his upcoming new reality show called The Dish. However, Shannon claimed that she was never paid for her time on the show or properly recognized as the executive producer, which was something that, according to her, was initially promised. During her appearance on the show, Mama June argued that Adam was using her likeness and name for his financial gain, in part because she had been doing reality TV for 11 years, and he also needed help with the money that was put aside for this project. But here is the real kicker, you guys a contract was never signed. When asked why Mama June never proposed a contract herself, she said she didn't ask because during that time she was in between management doing stuff on her own and at first she didn't think that Adam was going to constantly ask and ask and ask for her involvement. She added, I felt like I was being used. I have a life myself and I have a TV show myself so I can't produce his show for free. But just to play devil's advocate here, Adam denies that there was ever any type of a financial agreement between them, confirming that Mama June would be paid for her involvement of the show. He stated, I texted a contract to her back in early March of this year. She did not sign it, never acknowledged it at all. Because of that, Adam thought everything was perfectly fine. Him and Mama June had worked together several times throughout the years and had established a friendship with trust. Ultimately, however, the judge did rule in Mama June's favor, stating that her celebrity status was what drew Adam to her like a moth on a flame. The judge also demanded that Adam had to pay her the $5,000 and list her as the executive producer on this project. Believe it or not, Adam actually took this news very well, which is... <laughs> really questionable to me. But in his closing statement, he said that all he cared about was getting his friend back. And he ended his statement with saying that he also believed that Mama June deserved the executive producer title on this project, which was very near and dear to his heart. I will say just hearing him say that she deserves the executive producer title does make me also believe that she must have put a lot of time or money into this. As for Mama June's closing statement, she said that Adam was getting a really, really good deal. According to her, cases very similar to this one could run up to $25,000 and more. She also wished him well on this new reality show, saying that she hopes that it was successful and that he is happy with the fact that he put so much time and money into this project. Okay, so here's the real tea, you guys. After getting all this information, I did a little bit more research. I wanted to get to know this Adam guy a lot better, and I wanted to get the deets on this new reality show with Mama June. And with one swift click on YouTube, I was able to find this Adam guy, which I will link down below if you guys are interested in checking it out. We're also going to read the description and watch the trailer for the show, which is called The Dish. And the description says that it is set against the backdrop of the beautiful Treasure Coast, Florida. This gang of ridiculous reality TV misfits are trying everything to have a hit show and nothing is too ridiculous for them to give it a go. Middle-aged gay singer and producer Adam Barda just wants to have a hit web show called Hashtag The Dish and he's enlisted the help of friends like Mama June and Tam Mom to take it all the way. Recently widowed and rich housewife wannabe Cynthia has the pocketbook to go all the way, but does she have the drive? And even with the platform of the Howard Stern Show and Mama June, can this gay band of misfits go mainstream? And will friend slash enemy and rival Cynthia Beaumont upstage Adam to get her own moment in the spotlight? The show does sound kind of interesting, but you guys, there's something fishy going on here because when I went to go check out his channel, this live was done exactly one day ago, which means that he would have been in the area for this court TV live thing. And when the live chat was asking him why him and Matt weren't together, 
Carter, which I believe is his partner. He said he was out of town for quote unquote work. You and Matthew on the outs, Adam. No, I am actually, uh, hey, hey, Eric, welcome, welcome. Um, no, we are not on the outs. I am actually at work. We're not? Or are we? Why do you think you're over there? Well, well, that's another storyline for another time. Huh? Y'all can call me a conspiracy, but I believe that this whole sneeze was a publicity stunt. I don't think that there is any beef or ill will between Mama June and this Adam Barta guy. And personally speaking, I think all of this was done to promote this new show. This guy seems pretty happy for somebody that just got sued, don't you think? And he has also been promoting the crap out of this all over every social media platform and of course, name dropping the heck out of Mama June. You guys definitely do your own research, gather your own opinions. Like I said before, the links will be in the description below, but that is my opinion. As for the details on this reality show, it is going to be releasing on August 30th and you can watch it on Apple TV or the Google Play app. Adam does give all the details on the video that I'm talking about. I believe you can pre-order it for $2.99 and he does say that in the future it will be free. It's just gotta trickle down the line to get to there. But enough talking, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the clip. That way you get a little sneak peek of what the show is really gonna be like. That's Adam Barter. He's a Small Potatoes TV producer hoping to strike it big with a TV show about life there. Matt, if this fails, we're gonna be homeless. This is it. Like, we can finally do our reality show. What's the show gonna be about? That smell horrible. Did y'all smell that too? Wow. Adam, oh. you in his way. Oh. You cannot be your domestic animal. Well, let's start with that I take over the show. All right. Ooh, those people are nuts. Absurd. How hard could that be? Oh, oh my God, okay. Cynthia. It is actually the dish. Y'all, what did we just watch? Let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comments down below. Are you gonna be tuning into this show? And also, what are your thoughts on this whole court live TV thing? Do you think it was a publicity stunt or just Mama June trying to get the spotlight on her? Also, if you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and give it a big thumbs up, subscribe, and tap the bell if you have not already. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you all to the moon and stars and until the next one bye y'all